Here in New Orleans, space is hard to come by, especially mm -hmm. when it comes to our four-legged friends. Well, in December, the city started making room with its first ever free dog park. But did the city bite off more than it can financially chew? Jacqueline Kelly has more. When Tim Moore and his girlfriend were looking to adopt a dog, being able to find a dog park for their new addition, Lily, an eight-month-old terrier mix, never really crossed their minds. It was one of the first things we looked into, and I, I think we, the, my girlfriend and I were both extremely surprised at the lack of dog parks. Like many dog owners, they soon realized options were scarce. The closest ones beyond this were kind of unofficial ones. Uh, Pretty far away. So when Wisner Dog Run opened, dog owners in this uptown neighborhood were ecstatic. It's free, making it a first of its kind. The existing park was sectioned off with a fenced in area just for these furry friends. But the neighborhood group who helped make it possible says it wasn't an easy task. The city had never done this before, so we were both, you know, both friends of Wisner Park and the city um, were sort of going through this uh, brand new together. Not too long ago, the city said it would turn 20 green spaces around the city into dog parks, parks just like this one, where it's illegal to let your dog run off the leash. But then the city scaled back its plans after questions of how to fund and maintain these parks came up. Because one of the things that I think we realize is that you can't put up a fence, a chain link fence, and say, oh, now I've got a dog park. Jackie Shreves, the chair of the city's task force on dog parks, helped develop the rules and model in which Wisner Dog Run operates. She says through its growing pains, the city has learned a lot and says it will certainly serve as a blueprint for future dog parks. Then as the city goes forward, there's clearly a need in other areas. But the key being, again, um, is there a neighborhood group to support it? In Uptown, Jacqueline Kelly, Eyewitness News. A city spokesperson said that right now there are only plans to open one other dog park in addition to Wisner Dog Run. That'll be at Crescent Park in the Bywater. Officials say the city has installed the dog run and is currently finishing construction at the park. They say they're working to open it as quickly as possible.